Let's train this upper chest, those clavicular fibers with the incline Smith Machine bench press. So to set this up, you'll need a Smith Machine and an incline bench. You'll set the incline bench between about 30 and 45 degrees, whatever you're able to feel the best chest contraction with. So first thing, I like to drop this down just to make sure you're centered between left and right. This allows you to see what's going on. I have even space between the knurling and the smooth space and the bench on either side. So it's nice and even. All right, so I'm gonna sit down on the bench. I'm gonna lean back. And before I load up the weight, I wanna make sure the bar is coming to my chest properly. What I'm looking for is this bar to line nicely align the center or the upper chest and that should feel nice and comfortable. All right, so your hand position is gonna be very similar to a traditional bench press. I'm looking for a straight up and down forearm angle at the bottom of the rep. If my forearms are pointed outwards like this, that's gonna to be too wide. And if my forearms are pointed in like this, that's gonna to be too close, it's gonna be a lot of triceps. So we're gonna find, so we're gonna find a nice natural hand position. We're not gonna flare or tuck the elbows. We're gonna let those move naturally. Smooth eccentric, tap the chest, press up. Smooth eccentric, strong concentric. Smooth eccentric, strong concentric. All right, so our back here is gonna be placed against the pad evenly. I don't wanna arch, we're not turning this into a flat bench press. We want a nice flat back pressed against the pad. Big stretch, squeeze all the way up. 